now let us discuss about simplex stop and wait protocol for noisy channel so noisy channel means error channel this concept this protocol comes under elementary data link protocols first let us see why it is named as simplex stop and wait protocol for noisy or error channel simplex means the data can be transmitted in only one direction whereas stop and wait protocol means sender sends a frame to the receiver and then sender stops and waits for the acknowledgement from the receiver after receiving the acknowledgement only sender can sends another frame to the receiver uh, for noisy or error channel but here the communication channel has errors so there may be a possibility that we may get some errors so communication channel has errors errors let the sender sends a frame to the receiver so uh, there may be a possibility that uh, during transmission that frame may be lost or there may be a possibility that uh, some of the bits of the frame are corrupted that means some of the bits of the frame are damaged let us assume that uh, sender sends a frame to the receiver but during transmission that frame is corrupted or uh, damaged uh, let that frame arrived successfully at the receiver so now how receiver identifies that that is the corrupted frame that is the damaged frame so for that we have error de detection mechanisms the most commonly used mechanism is checksum so with the help of the checksum a uh, receiver can identifies whether it is the original frame or uh, corrupted frame suppose if it is original frame then the receiver accepts that frame suppose if it is corrupted frame then the receiver discards that frame uh, so let's see how the data will be transmitted from the sender to receiver here so here we have two missions the first mission is sender the second mission is receiver so let sender sends a frame to the receiver let sender sends a frame to the receiver here every frame will have a timer so sender will wait for the acknowledgement for the corresponding frame only for that for that uh, particular time period only if the time period expires then the sender will retransmits the same frame once again so here the sender sends a frame to the receiver and then sender stops and waits for acknowledgement for the corresponding frame so let us assume that uh, that frame received successfully at the receiver so receiver is providing some acknowledgement to the sender receiver is providing an acknowledgement to the sender let us assume that uh, uh, sender sends a frame to the receiver but this is a damaged frame corrupted frame some of the bits of the frame are damaged generally what will happen is at the receiver side uh, the receiver computes the checksum for error detection suppose if it identifies that it is a damaged frame then the receiver simply discards the frame receiver simply discards the frame but here we know that every frame will have a timer so the sender will wait for that particular time period only let the timer period is 20 milliseconds so sender will wait for only 20 milliseconds for the acknowledgement from the receiver let us assume that sender doesn't receive the acknowledgement here that frame is uh, that frame has some errors so what will happen now uh, the receiver may not send any acknowledgement to the sender so in that occasion after the time period expires sender thinks that during transmission that frame is lost so sender will retransmits the same frame once again the same frame once again and then uh, receiver receives that frame and provides acknowledgement for the frame now let us assume that sender sends 
another frame to the receiver another frame to the receiver so let that frame received successfully at the receiver side without any errors without any damages so what will happen now receiver provides acknowledgement to the sender but assumes that that acknowledgement is lost that acknowledgement is lost so in that occasion what will happen we know that every frame will have a timer so after the time period expires sender will retransmit the same frame once again sender will retransmit the same frame once again but is it original frame or duplicated frame it is duplicated frame why because already here this with this frame there is no problem there are no errors in this frame this is original frame only correct frame only so already receiver has this frame but but sender doesn't receives the acknowledgement so that's why sender retransmitted the same frame once again so now the sender has two frames with the same data with the same data so this is a problem this frame is nothing but duplicated frame this frame is nothing but duplicated frame so how we are going to solve this problem so sender has two frames duplicated frames in order to solve this problem sequence numbers are introduced sequence numbers are introduced so now every frame will have a sequence number so while sender is transmitting the frame it send it it appends the sequence number also so sender sends frame 0 to the receiver receiver is providing some acknowledgement but unfortunately that acknowledgement is lost so after the particular time period sender will retransmit the same frame once again so sender is retransmitting frame 0 once again so now receiver identifies that it has frame 0 already receiver has frame 0 already so now what will happen receiver simply discards this duplicated frame why because receiver already got frame 0 so this is the duplicated frame so receiver simply discards this duplicated frame and it provides acknowledgement for this frame 0 it, it it discards this duplicated frame and it provides acknowledgement for this frame 0 so in this way we can handle the noise or errors so this is about uh, simplex stop and wait protocol for noisy or uh, error channel